This is a fundoscopic image of a normal healthy fundus. The anatomic structures of the eye grounds that we will inspect include the optic disc, the blood vessels, the macula, and the background. Here we will focus on the optic disc, which is usually pale, orange to pink in color, is round with sharp margins, and has a cup to disc ratio of less than 0.5. In this case, there is a small degree of non-pathological pigmentation at the periphery of the disc. Now we will focus on the blood vessels of the retina. The central retinal artery and vein diverge from the optic disc in four branches – superior temporal, inferior temporal, superior nasal, and inferior nasal. The arterioles are lighter colored and more narrow than the venules. Vessel indentation is not normally present where arterioles and venules cross. This is the macula, which is located temporal to the disc. The fovea is a small area located in the center of the macula, which is void of visible vessels. Finally, regard the reddish background of the fundus. There aren't any excudates, hemorrhages, lesions, scars, or other signs of pathology. I hope you found this lecture to be helpful and worth your time. Please feel free and very welcome to leave a comment or suggestion below. And if you like this video, please hit subscribe and check out some of the other videos in this channel.